It is Wednesday, my dudes. This video is scheduled for one unboxing, introducing to you the Broke Beauty Guru and your host for Wrestling With Beauty, the Ring Queen, Lexa Rose! <clears throat> hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Wrestling With Beauty. Welcome back to my channel. Um, you must be a glutton for punishment if you're here watching this because honestly, like, yeah. To the 400 and plus subscribers, thank you guys for being so supportive and watching my videos from beginning to end. And we have an unboxing today. Of course, today's June Boxy Charm. Uh, today's video is brought to you by Boxy Charm. I'm not sponsored by them. I wish. But, you know, we about to open this box. So, as you can see, classic black box. Of course, everything inside. Today's, well, this month's theme is O Natural. I'm going to read off to you all the products that are in here. We have got the Elemis Superfood Vital Veggie Mask, which I will be doing a review on. The Butter London Natural Goddess Eyeshadow Palette, which is this one. Let me just open it up and show you. Mmm, pretty. We also have the Luxie Gaia 3-Piece Brush Set. Uh, the brushes include large eye blending, precision crease, and a foundation brush. Very nice. I can always use a new foundation brush. Um, we have the Alamar Cosmetics Mother of Pearl. Now, I really like their blush trio that came in, uh, I believe, last month's box, or was it May's box? I'm, as you can tell, I'm wearing the blush today. Very, very beautiful colors. Perfect with my skin tone. And then the last one is Appeal Gel Liner. Line and define your eyes or lips with our, your new Appeal Gel Liner. And the color of this one is Deep Talk, which... <laughs> with swatching some of this ish okay <clears throat> now obviously we can't swatch this I'm doing a review on this so of course let's start with the lip pencil and of course having nails can be a bit of a female dog when trying to open these and oh and I oh <laughs> oh yeah no oh, and I oh got it so, you know, of course, sometimes these packages can be a little difficult to open when you do have um, nails, you know, like mine. Mine's are acrylic. Uh, just a side note, um, I wear acrylic nails to protect my natural nails because my natural nails tend to, like, break when they get too, too long. Like, when they get a decent size, they start to break. I don't know if it's my diet. I don't know what the effing F is wrong with me, but I don't know what's wrong with me. But let's watch this and see how it looks. Wait a minute. I was going to say, like, honey. Okay, that's like a pretty nice brown color. I think it would go well with my eyebrows. But it's a nice lip pencil nonetheless. We are going to swatch the Alamar Mother of Pearl Lip Gloss. Now, you're not going to really see much because it's just a clear gloss with, um, like, silver reflex. Like, yeah, it's pretty much silver reflex, so you're not really going to see much. But as you can tell, it's a great lip topper for whatever, like, colors you're wearing. I would prefer to wear like nice coral nudes with this because it'll really make it pop, especially during the summer. Um, 
And now let's check out the Butter London. This is the first time I've actually owned a, you know, item from them. So I'm a little excited. Uh, we've got all these colors. We've got Enchantress, Queen, Appropriate, uh, Star, Diva, Temptress, and Femme Fatale. So obviously there is four shimmer shades and two matte shades. So let's try and one, two, three, four, five, six. Mm. Let's check out Femme Fatale and see how that looks. Okay, pigment. We'll try out Temptress just to see how it looks. Formula doesn't feel too bad either. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, oh. Let me try this, like, green metallic army camouflage color, which is Star. Well, I'll be damned. This is some... What? Oh. Sorry. That's the love of my life trigger. But, yeah, this... Wow. Uh, I would show you the rest of the colors, but if you have a boxy charm, you already know, but... The formula feels nice. It doesn't feel dry, like chalky or anything like that. It feels like a mix between creamy and powdery, which I personally like because that means it's easier to blend. Like for me, um, I have a hard time blending creams. I'm just, I'm not a big fan of creams unless it's cream contour and stuff. So let's check out what the brushes look like. A nice little organic packaging. I live for that. Very biodegradable. Save the squirrels. So this is the eye blending, which is really nice and soft. Wow, this is better quality than the ones I got from freaking wish.com. Even though the wish.coms are also bomb.com, but I'm gonna be trying this out. So and this is the foundation brush. Ooh. Ooh, this is nice and soft. Definitely gonna use this for like actual foundation because the foundation brush that I have, I actually use for face masks. It's Lancome too, you would think. Like, bitch, what the fuck? <laughs> oh, welcome to the descent of my madness. I also wanted to give you guys a little bit of um, an update on how things are going. Um, I got myself a law job. Um, I'm probably going to mention that in my dusty uh, makeup tutorial. So when you see that one, you'll hear me mention it because that was filmed prior to this one. But this one's going up first. You catch what I'm saying. Uh, this is the concealer brush. Um, but yeah, a little quick update about what's been going on in the world of Miss Lexa Rose. Um, just recently wrestled for ECPW Long Island again against Eris Rain. Uh, of course... I won, but unfortunately, uh, there was a new uh, opponent, I guess a new beast of the women's division called Cordelia Crush, in which she attacked Eris and I after trying to show each other respect after our match. So, um, if you haven't seen it on my Instagram, I'll be posting up the actual match later on. Um, I will probably try and link it into the video, um, but yeah, stay tuned for that match. I still have to edit it and stuff like that, um, but it should be up soon. Um, I'm going to be wrestling for Code Red Wrestling July 13th. If you're watching this way after, then we've wrestled for Code Red Wrestling. Um, I'll give you guys an update on that in my later videos. Uh, but that's what's been going on. I finally got myself a better law job, and I'm really happy where I am. I'm not getting yelled at every five minutes for dumb crap. And I'm really happy. It's a great team of women, you know, who <clears throat> definitely have, you know, knowledge and have been dispensing their knowledge and dropping bombs of truth and advice on me. So it's been really cool. Um, I'm learning to delve deep into the world of probate law and estates so that's something I'm really looking forward to doing uh, the only thing I used to know how to do was 
wills and healthcare proxies and stuff like that and codicils, but I only did like the beginning part, like I prepared the will. Um, what I'll be learning to do is when those wills have to be used when people die, that's when I have to tell the court like, hey, they died, we've got people here that are supposed to be getting assets and stuff. So it's a whole new entire uh, frontier that I am literally delving myself into. I'm hella terrified. I'm hella terrified. Hella terrified. But one thing that I've always appreciated is breaking out of my comfort zone and learning how to try new things because that's the only way you can learn how to grow. So with that being said, that's my update. I hope you enjoyed my unboxing. It was a little less maddening than my last one where I just couldn't hide my allergies and I was covered in glitter and stuff thanks to that Pure Festival palette. Whew, great palette too. Um, what I'm actually wearing today is the Riviera palette uh, today. And I'm wearing on my cheeks the Alomar that came, the uh, Alomar blush trio that came with the other boxy charm, uh, month, couple months prior. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please like, subscribe, share with your friends. You know, let them see some crazy fat wrestling chick. You know, reviewing makeup, trying on makeup, doing makeup tutorials, and putting up wrestling videos and stuff like that. You know what I'm saying? Like for reals. <clears throat> Y que si yo ni que. Ah. Pero. Entonces. Thank you for watching. I will see you on my next video. And keep it Gucci Gucci bitches. <laughs>